And she's pushing out a bean. <laughs> it fell on Nugget's head. Great Gatsby. Hey guys! Today's video is all about things guinea pig owners would never tell you. After all, having guinea pigs as pets is quite different than seeing cute and adorable videos of them. So here are 5 big secrets that guinea pig owners don't really talk about. It can be overwhelming. Keeping guinea pigs as pets on good days is amazing. They're funny, full of personality, cute, they can cheer anyone up. But the bad days? That's a whole other story. Caring for one sick guinea pig can already be pretty demanding, but if you have two piggies that are seriously sick, you really run into trouble. Some illnesses require almost constant care. Guinea pigs eat near all of the time, so if they stop eating, which unfortunately they kind of often do once they're sick, you need to syringe feed them every two hours, even during the night. Even the most organized, on top of everything person becomes overwhelmed at one point. If you keep a large herd of guinea pigs, chances are at one point everything will seem to be happening at once. And as soon as you think you got it under control, something else will flare up, keeping you in crisis mode for much longer than expected. No one likes mess. It doesn't matter which type of bedding you choose, whether that's fleece or traditional bedding, guinea pigs make a lot of mess. Strands of hay somehow always end up everywhere, even when you're 1000% sure you didn't drop any while refilling the guinea pig's hay. Hay just has the superpower to find its way into everything. Also, even super allergy friendly hay is still somewhat dusty and don't even get me started on the piggy superhero kick, which transports small piggy beans out of the cage onto your freshly cleaned hardwood floors. And she's pushing out a bean. <laughs> it fell on Nugget's head. Great Gatsby. Not to mention fur that sticks to anything. Cleaning after piggies is a ton of work and your space will never be entirely clean. At least not for longer than 5 minutes. While of course we all love our guinea pigs and love taking care of them, no one really likes mess. If you visit your friend owning guinea pigs and their house is spotless, they probably cleaned it just for you. Probably also 5 minutes prior to you arriving. It can be lonely. Not a lot of people are that enthusiastic about guinea pigs. While many people have seen, interacted with or even kept guinea pigs at one point, few people you meet in real life are super pig fans. It can be quite lonely when others don't exactly get your obsession with a pet that is often considered a starter pet or a children's pet, even though of course guinea pigs are anything but. It can slowly break you. I usually don't talk about loss too much as I like to keep this page carefree and happy. But losing pets is very hard and it doesn't really get any easier. Especially if you've encountered lots of losses in a relatively short period of time, had really heartbreaking stories or had to say goodbye to piggies that were on the younger side, this really feels like it's slowly breaking you. It takes a huge toll. The upside is that there's always a happy and calm period just waiting around the corner, but at least I feel like keeping a larger herd of guinea pigs over lots of years eventually leads to a loss of being totally carefree when it comes to your pigs. You also might be able to appreciate years that are going super well more than you previously were, but unfortunately you also know how easy things can change. I feel like this sounds super dark and of course most of the time owning guinea pigs is amazing and you have more periods of non-sickness than sickness. It's just that a longer than usual period of frequent illnesses or loss is unfortunately something that most guinea pig owners will experience if they keep larger herds for many many years. You can of course also just get lucky and get a guinea pig like Sylvester who was never sick and lived a very long and happy life. Which is what we all hope for for our pets. However, the toll that keeping guinea pigs can sometimes take doesn't get talked about that often. It's the most amazing thing. And despite all of that just listed, it's the most amazing thing. Guinea pigs are fun and sassy and happy and cute. They know what they want and aren't scared to ask for it. They love life and they're just perfect. It is absolutely worth it to keep guinea pigs as pets. 
When you keep guinea pigs, your life will be full of sunshine and rainbows. At least about 90% of the time. And it might help to know about the other 10% and to know that you're not alone. These were a couple of things guinea pig owners won't usually tell you. Also, in case you want to see the lighthearted version of this, be sure to leave a comment. I hope you enjoyed this video and see you guys next time! Bye!